Hello guys, I'm back again. So we are talking about the uh, Kublai K5L. If you have been watching my previous video regarding the K5, the Kublai, so uh, basically it was not so impressed at all. So now today, again, a disappointment on the uh, Kublai uh, gel blaster. All right. So uh, the price it's about two to three times compared to the ordinary blasters. So uh, we can actually consider the Kublai is the premium class of gel blaster. So I'm quite new to gel blasters. So I'm not very sure about what's so special about Kublai. All right, after all, this is my first Kublai because um, all the review was saying that or other players were saying that Kublai it's uh, one of a kind. It's the class, it's a premium class gel blaster. Okay, so I'm not going to talk about much about it. So uh, let's move on to it. What was the disappointment which I face? Okay, this unit was with me for not more than two months and uh, I would say it, it, it is uh, it was not even played for more than five hours at uh, accumulation so uh, then um, I already dismantled the parts because we, I have some problems so uh, no doubt about it the uh, handguard is very good very nice I must say I totally agree with it. It's a premium class, nice. And then the in the outer barrel, okay, is uh, plastic. This also plastic, and this gas blow uh, gas block is metal. All right, this is also good. But I'm not very, um, how should I say, it? not very uh, uh, happy about the outer barrel because it is plastic and it is quite soft you see when I press it can you see it's very soft right um, not so impressed and this as well is a plastic but this one is better so then talk about the inner barrel inner barrel is plastic it's a plastic inner barrel and it's very easy to bend. So I presume for this kind of blaster, there would be a lot of vibrations, you know, throughout the barrel when the uh, the uh, gearbox, the piston is moving. So when it is having vibrations, then you will lose accuracy and uh, on the gel and the gel ball when coming out, shooting out from the barrel itself. So you will not get any like a uh, very straight line and uh, sort of things, right? And yes, it is plastic. Okay, so we, we move on to the other parts. Uh, this is the uh, upper shell. Uh, very good. This one, I must say, is very good. It's sort of alloy metal. Okay, okay let's forget about other things. We talk about the major issue today. Um, this is the gearbox and you can see this is the blowback mechanism right and um, can you see this part this part was broken it was broken last week when I have some uh, target practice at my friend's house the yeah, okay and this suddenly it just stopped working no, it's not moving at all. So then last night I dismantled, then I noticed it was like this. Okay, you see? So it was, you know, this part is here and this is over here. So when I dismantled, then I found out you can see the broken uh, shiny part, the silver part actually is broken. It should be at here and it's broken. So now, when the piston uh, pulls back, pulls back, 
so this actually the dummy plate the dummy bolt this part should be uh, following at the same time and when they release pushing forward this also goes forward and now this little part here which is pull connected over here which is when the piston reverse it will pushes this part this will follow as well and now it's broken and it is not working okay what a disappointment to Kublai how can this happen it is not so heavy I did not do any modification on this gearbox on the spring or whatsoever parts on this blaster it is originally no modification was done at all and this is broken and it is not even more than two months Kublai I think you have to I mean whoever watched this video or whoever is related or have some communication or connection to Kublai please tell them to improve this what a shameful thing even worse than the ordinary cheaper blaster okay then now I have to search online to look for a replacement part for this I bought this blaster because people were saying Kublai is premium class and this blowback is so fantastic and beautiful but end up to be a disaster okay I do not want to speak more on this I'm not against anybody or any product or Kublai or whatever but this part is really a disappointment okay all right so please do not mock me or whatever I just telling the truth what I face and what I think of you know uh, okay since you are doing this blowback mechanism I presume you should test it out to the maximum okay I'm not even bring it to the games it's just for target practicing and not for more than one or two minutes you know normally I shoot about five seconds then it stop okay, I would not do continuous uh, shooting at all okay so I think that's all from me I do not wish to talk more about it thank you very much for watching this if you have any comments perhaps you can advise me actually what went wrong on this part here Okay, thank you very much. Goodbye.